Most people play life safe. It's easy to grab the video game and put it on novice. It allows you to get to the end. But when you play it on novice, you don't improve. You never find out what you can be because you've never been tested. It's the same way with life. As long as you play it safe, you will always be an underachiever. When you don't know what's possible because you never tried, nothing but guilt, frustration, and resentment can set up inside of your heart for the rest of your life. But what do people go watch when they go see a movie? They watch a romantic adventure. Well, why? Because that's what they want in their life. They don't want peace and tranquility, the pleasures of infantile, gratified infantile dependence. They want a bloody adventure. How do you create your life? You get hungry for something, don't you? You started with a concrete vision of what you wanted and you focused on it continuously, didn't you? Wherever focus goes, energy flows. You envision something, you got clear about it, and then you start thinking about all the reasons why you wanted it. So this is what's next for me now. I want this. You may have dreamed about it, thought about it, talked about it. But when you focus on something continuously, something magical happens. You get insights, don't you? Success is the only revenge. All you do is like, is you just become bigger than them. Like, so that who they are in reference to you shrinks into a level. Like you don't crush them, you shrink them in comparison to you. The goal is like, I'll just be so big that he will become a relic. Let loose everything that's inside of you to find out what you can be. Pour out that can of what's possible so that the rest of the world can see that you're amazing. Sit on your bed one day and ask yourself, what remarkably stupid things am I doing on a regular basis to absolutely screw up my life? And if you actually ask that question, but you have to want to know the answer, right? Because that's actually what asking the question means. It doesn't mean just mouthing the words. It means you have to decide that you want to know. You'll figure that's out so fast it'll make your hair curl. What would happen if you consulted yourself about the best possible outcome for you? You might get an answer. The only thing that screws you up is limiting beliefs that you don't investigate, that you just accept. And it's two things. It's the state you're in, the mental emotional state. When you're pissed off, frustrated, sad, depressed, overwhelmed, you can't fight your way out of a paper bag, right? Because in that state, you're not resourceful. If you are feeling playful or creative or passionate or driven or hungry or grateful, you get a whole different set of insights and thoughts. You need to make it a habit to start every day validating yourself because life is a marathon.